And welcome to another episode of Here You Can Tell mm-hmm. Diaries of a Master Sushi Chef. Hello, son, how are you? Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon mm-hmm. to you. Got a great recipe. Actually, it's more of an instructional video. Mm-hmm. How to fillet a whole salmon. Yep, this is actually the second time that we do a uh, whole salmon uh, fillet, the open cut. Uh, we have done before was almost how many years ago? Five years ago? Probably five or more years ago. Mm-hmm. And it's your most popular video, but since we have better lighting, better camera, mm. better setting, it's quieter. So we're gonna do it again. Yeah, you wanted to do it again. Mm. So this is a whole summer actually that we already scared off already, mm-hmm. and the cream, everything. Right. So, so we're gonna go into the uh, uh, cutting the uh, uh, fillet. And just so everybody knows, this fish was five thousand mm. seventy nine pounds, seventeen point one seven pounds. It's about. A hundred dollars for this fish. Mm. Yeah, close to a hundred dollars for today. So. so the head parts, actually two different way. Um, actually, I'm gonna go cut off the head on this line. Okay. After the gill, this is the one way. Or just, uh, some people do just a straight down cut in here. Right. And uh, this is a, uh, how they call the kama area. So if you, uh, I mean, uh, for the, at the restaurant, if you're selling uh, with that uh, salmon kama or something, so you can put a little bit of meat on it from this area to maybe this much. Okay. So this is a section kama. And people usually so, grill that, right? right. Yeah, grill, grill kama, whatever, you know, yeah. marinate. Or oh, well, if you don't, I mean, it's not really necessary, you just cut all the way cut on this way. You don't need to put the meat on in the kama area. Okay. Just straight to cut down here. Cut down here. Some people actually do the, 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 this way too. Actually, I plan to use the uh, after filler and everything, and the head parts and the belly parts. Uh, we are going to make a uh, salmon miso soup. Okay. So I'm gonna use the head too. So I'm gonna cut off head. Uh, this this moment I'm gonna go this way. Okay. This way. From here, just sit down. Top it down like this one. Right anyway, salmon is very, very soft. All the bones, you know, very easy. And like that. And then this one. Like that. Then I'm gonna actually ch- turn around okay. the salmon. This way. You can see. I set the guide line on the gear and here. Like that. Then I'm gonna take after taking all this in the gear. Okay. So I just put the head in here. And then we're gonna take off this part. Here. You can see in the bone here and the center, the bone here. Like okay, there's this a center bone. Right, go like that. And then switch into the back. This one. He has a bone. Right. The center. All the way. Okay. And grab, grab the tail. Okay, one side is done. This way. So next one, I'm gonna take off this one, center. Okay. And here. Take one off. 
I'm gonna take off the comma out. Yeah. Okay. Next one, I'm gonna take with the very the bone. Okay. Okay. Let's go. This is the bone. Okay. Then I'm gonna cut off the. I'm gonna cut off the the berry this much. Okay. That's the my favorite part here. Berry. My okay, favorite part of the here. fish. Okay. And then I'm gonna clean off this one. They have another bone here. Okay. So I'm gonna clean off these parts. From here, all the way to the end. And that's just the top layer, right? Right. I can hear some bone in there. Okay. These things are you can you can a little bit uh, clean up a little bit later after. Okay, that's it. And then this pillar has another one here. You can you can see that little bit sticking out. Yeah. Yeah. This one I'm gonna take it off. This one I'm gonna use that tweezer. Same way. I'm gonna first cut off the camera. Straight down. Okay, take it off the belly bone. Very bone out. Okay. And then same way. Some berry and out. And then and center of the bone. 